all human decisions are determined by our values. What you see here is the literal translation of advertising into ethical statements that design actually the ranking of values for the citizen. This is a brain factory. This is where you will be invited to become brain workers because you use EEG, electroencephalography headbands. What you see on the screen is what we call the biofeedback after the phase of calibration. And the biofeedback shows you a shape that evolves constantly. You get a QR code that you scan with your wallet and immediately the token will go to your wallet. You can decide to collect it or you decide to make an artwork out of it. Let's imagine that it's a new calligraphy. This is happiness, this is humor, this is uh, trust, pleasure, honesty, friendship, love, time, freedom, and so on. As we are giving a shape to the value, in a way we are creating a new language. This AI takes the 3D model, rotate it, and try to figure out what kind of Chinese character could match the shape. And so that this is a kind of constant process. Regarding human values, I suggested to create a periodic table of values. The periodic table of elements that classify all elements in the universe is based on the atomic weight. We don't know the atomic weight of values. So I decided that we would pay attention to how people collect values. Then the one in your collection determines the proximity and the affinity between values. Here on the left you see the newly trade created tokens. Transactional poetry is a simple transcription of the transaction you are doing. So that's what transactional poetry inspired also the first room. Here you can see what is the dominant value per country. At the bottom you see the evolution of the price for the different values. Reification is a concept that has been developed by Marx to explain that things are converted like that and values become objects. This is a footprint of freedom generated with an AI. Here is to say that like we pay attention to the footprints of the dinosaurs because they vanished, we may pay attention to the footprint of freedom. Of course, it becomes more meaningful. The conceptual map represents 40 years of work from 82 to 2022. Instead of classifying the works according to the technology that was used or the medium, it's classified according to the concepts that are behind. Value of values that we present in the show Morphogenesis of Values is about human values, how we consider human values, what is important for us. In this kind of work, there is no conclusion. Every new presentation is a new work.